Hey y'all, happy Saturday. Let me mute this TV. Um, it is April 20th. It is probably, what time is it right now? It's 4.56. I'm having girls night tonight. Um, I just cleaned the bathroom in here. Um, and I'm having girls night. We have some bottles of the new Ciroc summer watermelon flavor. And we thought it would be cool to just get some crabs and just have a ladies night because we haven't had one in a while. So I wanted to show you some of the stuff that I got. While I was in Walmart today, I saw this little cute pack. And I got it from my parents' house because they're always grilling. I can't eat any of this stuff on keto. Um, but it's four different kinds of barbecue sauce. There's barbecue, let's see, Carolina mustard style, Kansas City sweet and smoky, Memphis sweet and spicy. And then there's a Hawaii style sweet and smoky as well. Um, so I got this. It was like five or six bucks. So I got that. And also at Walmart, if for all of my keto babes, these are really good. The um, sugar free. Now it does have xylitol in it, but um, I only eat a couple at a time. They have the big bags at Walmart. I think they're like six dollars. CVS also sells the smaller bags as well. I did get two gift bags for my niece's clothes that I showed you, and. What else? Let me turn the camera around to show you guys what I got and what I pulled out of my stash. Because y'all know I always got party stuff. So I pulled some stuff out of my stash. Hold First, on. when I was in Target, um, my outdoor pillows are blue and green. So I got these. They're in the Target dollar spot for a dollar. I got two blue ones and two green ones. And it's two in a pack. So that's a total of eight. I figured our next ladies night, if we do like grilling or something, these would be cute or whatever. So I'm going to get some melamine um, dishware and stuff for outside too. And I'll probably get blue and green. Um, but I thought these little baskets were cute, especially if there's, you know, if people bring their kids or whatever. That's just random um, stuff. But when I was in Walmart today, I saw this and I thought it was so cute, too. It's a covered tray. It was $9.98 or something. Um, one of the ladies tonight is bringing a whole watermelon and they're going to slice it up. So I thought this would be cute to display on the table. It's so pretty. They had different um, designs as well. And then over here, I went into my stash. Let me move these. So... I purchased this stuff from Walmart today because I was in there and they were like 97 cents for the trays and you know crabs are big and stuff like that so each person it's only four of us can have a tray and then there's a pack of four bowls now these bowls are dishwasher top rack only safe but they're not microwave safe so if anybody wants to melt butter they'll have to melt it first and then put it in here um, because you can't Put this in the microwave and i want everything on the table to match while i was cleaning out my basement and garage last night i found a ton of tablecloths so my brother's on his way with the party table basically because we're going to sit in the living room and watch the beyonce movie and then this is stuff that i got from my stash some drink parasols we really like to be fancy um, when we get together i got these from the target dollar spot last summer and they said girls just want to have sun so i thought that was cute i got these last year or yeah last year around um valentine's day i think they're just drink stirs but they're pink and then i got these plastic gold straws i got the pink ones too but i wanted to change it up and use the gold ones these were a dollar at the dollar spot as well so that is one reason why i like to pick up stuff when i see it because impromptu girls nights or parties i already have everything so that is what i'm gonna do i'm gonna set up the um table in there and then i'll just put four chairs around it and we will watch um the beyonce movie on netflix um i still have to um straighten up a bit and tackle those dishes over there before the ladies get here i think some of them are going to be late they said maybe seven o'clock we were supposed to start at six but stace and harper are going to come over and we're going to go pick up the crabs drop harp off at my parents house and come back here and just like chill out until the rest of the ladies get here so yeah, I hope you guys are having a good Saturday. I just wanted to come and show you guys that. Um, oh, I wanted to show you guys the shoes that I got. Yeah, I need to put all my shoes upstairs. This is ridiculous. But these are the shoes that I got from JCPenney's last night. They're really, really cute. And they're tied together though. And they're so cute, look at them. And I like the block heel on them and they're like a magenta color or a fuchsia color, so. I wanted to wear those with those Fashion Nova jeans, but I'm going to have to find some other cute jeans because the Fashion Nova ones were definitely a miss. So, yeah. What else did I want to show you guys? I think I showed you guys the stuff for my niece yesterday. 
I got her all this stuff. Yeah, I showed you guys. Look at this stuff I got her. Now, it's supposed to be for her birthday in July, but I think I'm going to give it to her because I'm just pressed and I'd like to see um, her happy. So, I got her. She's in love with LOL. You guys already know. So, I got her some LOL glasses from Target. And then I had no idea they have LOL clothing there. Now, technically, this is bigger than her size. I think she's in like... 3T or 2T, but I got the extra small and 4 or 5. She can wear it with leggings or jeans. And I liked the shirts because they have the little brown girl LOL on them too. So I got her this one and then I got her this one right here. And they have three of them on this one. I thought that was cute. And then I got her this to wear over her leotards for dance or whatever um, when she's leaving, you know. I thought this one was cute. This one is a sleeveless one, but it says fierce and it has three LOLs on there. And then I picked these up for her as well because these were just so darn cute. Look at these. You know, she used to be a mini girl. Now she's LOL all the way. But these are just so cute. So I thought she would just love these. Oh my goodness. Um, so they're probably on their way over and I'll just give her her stuff. Um, I already have something for her, a big gift for her for her birthday. And I'll figure out Christmas closer to that time. So what else? I'm about to do these dishes and yeah oh i wanted to show you guys i went to victoria's secret because they sent me these free um panty coupons if you purchase something oh that's my brother just pulling up and this is what i purchased it was on sale for six dollars so i got a free panty that was like worth eleven dollars or ten fifty it's called aloha from paradise i couldn't really smell the difference in all of their lotions when i was there um but the packaging on this one was pretty and i figured i'd take it to jamaica with me because i'll be in paradise so yeah, that's all I really did today. Oh, I went to the eye doctor today and got a trial pair of some contacts because I want to try them out on special occasions. So let me go let my brother in and then I'll try to film once I set up the table for ladies night. Good afternoon, guys. It is Easter, April 21st. Happy Easter, everyone. Happy Resurrection Sunday. As you guys can see, I look a hot, busted mess. You guys, so we had an impromptu ladies' night last night, <laughs> not knowing that Easter was tomorrow when we said we were going to do it. It wasn't really impromptu. I guess it was because we knew a few days in advance when they dropped the, the day they dropped the new flavor of Ciroc, I knew, but it just we it didn't dawn on us that easter was the next day and you know my friends have children so you know doing the whole church and easter you know all that other stuff and you know family stuff or whatever like they that's their they gotta do it you know so yeah everybody's hurting today basically it was supposed to start at six and it get started until eight because the place we were going to get the crabs from they were sold out so we had to go to another place and then some of the ladies um just had things happen in their schedule where they were going to be late so we started around eight and everybody didn't leave until like 1 1 15 but we had a good time we watched the Beyonce homecoming Netflix special and we just you know talked and stuff like that the Ciroc summer watermelon flavor is really really good I like it it's really good um I'm gonna have to get my father a bottle because um I know he wants to try it I told him I would get him a bottle if we liked it we only drank one of our bottles we had two um so we have to get together again to get drink the other bottle um everybody couldn't like really really like drink the way they wanted to because Easter was the next day and people had to cook including myself I thought I was going to bake my lemon pound cake my keto lemon pound cake last night because it needs to sit in the refrigerator overnight but that didn't happen um, because I went to bed when everybody left. I was exhausted. Cleanup was really easy. It was really cute. The ladies loved it. And most 90% of the stuff I already had in my arsenal because I'm always buying little cute entertaining stuff from like the Target Dollar Spot or wherever I am. Um, and so I finally got a chance to pull all that stuff out. But we are going to have to get together again to drink that other bottle. I ordered uh, well, I paid for and bought, purchased a grill yesterday, but Lowe's is putting it together for me. So my brother's going to pick it up for me next Saturday. Um, and then after that, so maybe we'll have something like outside on my deck, whatever. I don't know, cookout type thing just for the girls and we can, you know, partake in the second bottle. I did buy some cute little um, food basket, plastic food baskets um, that are blue and green. I think I showed them to you guys. Um, 
for outside or whatever so and I already have my pillow so I just need to get my outdoor furniture after you know I finish um, taking care of my Jamaica trip so I'm excited about that it was really fun yesterday just to let loose and you know um, just hang out with the girls a little bit and having that time is really good sometimes us getting together our schedules it's really hard to get all of our schedules together because it is four of us and three of us three, or three of them have children um, but when we all can come together it's a good time so we had a good time I was supposed to bake the keto lemon pound cake last night I didn't and I told myself I was gonna get up at the crack of dawn and do everything today homegirl did not wake up until 9 o'clock in the morning and I was tired so I made 36 deviled eggs well 18 deviled eggs which made 36 eggs um, and then I made the keto lemon pound cake and I figure it'll be okay because we won't eat it until dessert time it's already been in my refrigerator for um, two hours so as long as it gets like six more hours at my mom's house it'll be fine and then I'm gonna make zucchini au gratin um, oh you know what I forgot my heavy whipping cream I gotta go back to the house anywho um, I'm gonna make zucchini au gratin when I get to my mother's house because she has the zucchinis there um, and the onion and I have everything else so yeah I'm gonna do that and what else or did I remember it I don't know that I remembered it hold on the bag is down here on the floor I don't think I remembered it I didn't it's at home um so yeah we're gonna do that and then that's all three of my contributions this year um, i'm tired guys you guys should see my outfit i took a shower and i was gonna get cute and i was just like no i have on like the biggest sweatpants i have on my sparkly loafer sandals with some socks on <laughs> and i have on i have on a hunter green shirt because i was gonna wear my hunter green air maxes but then when it came time to put my shoes on i was like i think i want to wear my my loaf my slipper loafers they're really cute but I look like a bum honestly I'm clean but I am tired and um, the girls are like kind of hurting today too so uh, my friends so yeah um, and then tomorrow starts a new week like this week flew by like flew 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 by so yeah um, that's the plan for today just to eat dinner have a little bit of keto with the lemon pound cake and come home. I didn't take anything out to thaw, so yeah. When I run in here, maybe I'll take out some salmon and I'll air fry that um, tonight when I come home. My plan is to be back by seven, but I don't know if that's gonna happen. We'll see, because um, I do usually help clean up and stuff like that on holidays and you know. Um, so yeah. guys what are you guys doing for easter let me know your plans i've been looking at um instagram seeing all the cute pictures of everybody I'm just tired like but it's just tired Ugh, i'm so tired um by now you will have seen the pictures from last night i didn't really record just because we were just having our moment or whatever um but i did take some before pictures so you could see the setup it was super simple like i said i went upstairs in my arsenal and just pulled out stuff that i already had um and the ladies just thought it was so cute and so me uh, so um yeah that was cool um what else I looked at the furniture again um, at Big Lots. I'm, I'm really torn between getting a, a sectional and getting, you know, like a, a five piece set with a, so, um, a sofa and two chairs and then a coffee table. I really, I don't know. I'm like torn between getting a sectional. I don't know. Um, I think I, I, I would like the flow of a sectional better. And I think I could lay on it and it would be cool, but I don't know, like, eh, I don't know. So, yeah, I just wanted to get on here to say happy Easter, guys. I'm almost back home to get my heavy whipping cream for this um, recipe that I got from the Cole Burgess channel. 
if it comes out right i'll snap a picture and tag her in it <laughs> um like i did the lemon cake and like i did the um parmesan crusted pork chop parmesan dion dijon mustard pork chops um but so far um everything that i made from her has been a hit so yeah i want to try her banana bread banana nut bread but i can't find the banana extract i've been looking at walmart i don't think i looked in giant because i forgot no i did look in giant i looked in giant and walmart and i didn't see it um and yeah so as soon as i can find that i'll try that i ran out of almond flour after i made this cake so i'll have to get some more of that but um yeah so i will talk to you guys later bye hey y'all it is Tuesday, April 23rd. It's about 2.35, y'all, and I'm headed home um, because I just got the call from the freight delivery company that my two accent chairs are being delivered um, in about an hour. So I'm headed home to get those. Only a half a day for me today. That's okay. I also wanted to try to get to Home Goods to see if I could find like an accent table to put in the center of them because from the furniture store, I'm only purchasing a sofa and a coffee table so i wanted to get like a small accent table to put in front of i mean in between them um and before i order something online i wanted to see what home goods has i also haven't been to home goods in a while like months so um yeah i just want to see you know what they have so that's the plan for today i also need to go to cvs because i have some extra care bucks that are expiring um today and I need to get paper products. And I think I'm going to take a break from couponing for a while. I don't know. We'll see. Um, so I may just use all of it. I think I have like $23 or something. Just use it all for um, paper towels and toilet tissue. But we'll see. Maybe. Um, what else do I want to talk to you guys about? Um... I did not meal prep this week, so I need to do that tonight as well. Because of Easter, I, I just got thrown off. I was already cooking for Easter, and I was tired when I got home, so I did meal prep. I've been spending money on food. Yesterday, I was sick because I was just eating random stuff. Um, I didn't actually have a full meal until very late at night. I went to Wendy's and got a junior bacon cheeseburger and took the bun off, and then I got a um, Parmesan Caesar salad or something. I ate that while I was laying in bed. I was so tired. But by that point, it was like 9.30. I had not eaten a full meal the entire day and I was nauseous, my stomach was hurting, I was cramping, like it was just craziness. But I definitely woke up feeling better, so that's good. I'm grateful for that. Um that was just that's just a reminder that I need to make it a priority to eat and even though I knew I didn't have anything meal prepped, I should have went and got some lunch, but I ended up leaving work and then coming back and I didn't get any lunch and I didn't drink enough water so I've been trying to not drink any of like the Zevias or the ice drinks or anything and just been focusing on water um, today because I just need to you know hydrate my system so that's what I'm doing I'm excited about my chairs though um, I think what needs to be done is the feet need to be added to them so we'll see I still have that um, fold-up table in the middle of my living room so I need to get my brother to come over and take that back to my parents house um, or at least I could put it, maybe I'll put it in the, um, in the basement for now and then put the four chairs back at the dining room table. Um, my love seat still needs to be moved to my basement because that's where the two chairs are going to go. But in the meantime, I think I'm just going to push the chairs into the foyer, um, entryway area. And then I'll go to Home Goods and see what's cooking at Home Goods, see what they have there. So yeah, super excited. Oh, I'm almost ready to buy my furniture. One of the credit bureaus has already increased my score tremendously. And my, my score is not bad or anything, but it took a hit because I only had one credit card. Uh, I'm giving you all my personal information. I only had one credit card and I maxed it out. Um, and so it looked like, well, it was 100% of my credit was being used. So I went ahead and paid that way, way down. So that boosted my score well past what it was before i'm just waiting on that was um experian has already reported it they reported it today and it increased my score so i'm just waiting on transunion to you know adjust theirs and then i'll get that other card with the travel perks on it 
so that I can um, put my furniture and also put the resort, the rest of the resort fee for Jamaica on it because I already have the cash to pay for all of that stuff. Um, but I want the free, the travel money, obviously. So yeah, so I'll be ordering my furniture very, very soon. Um, I don't know if I told you guys, but there's a Lowe's is selling. No, I think I did the Samsung washer and dryer, and I've been itching for it. But I'm like, Internet, just wait, 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 wait. Like, don't get it now. Just wait it off. It's a, it's a Samsung front load washer and dryer, and it looks rose gold in person, but the color is actually champagne. It looks really, really nice. Right now, they're on sale for nine hundred dollars each. Originally, they're a thousand dollars each, which is absurd but it looks so nice and i think it would match my foyer area so nice because pink is the accent colors gray pink and white and because these look rose gold it's just like so nice but um my ex-husband and i purchased front loaders for our single family home and we were only in it for two years and then we sold the house and we left the, the machines in there and it's just like and eh, do i really want to invest in machines like this if it's not my forever home right now or whatever I, I mean I wouldn't mind putting a front loader in here and I still plan to but do I want to invest in these you know for this house or whatever but um I don't know I'm kind of torn we'll see I'm definitely not buying it at the $900 price so it'll have to be around for a while but you know you know how when you get that itch and you see something and it's like oh my goodness like that's pretty much how I feel about it I love it so yeah um but so nice so one of you guys i can't remember who it is somebody i follow on instagram posted a picture and i went to the website immediately after i saw it i sent it to my friends like y'all this is me this is me and they were like yeah but it do the same thing that a you know a regular wash machine would do and it, it does but um i am gonna put front loaders in my um in my house eventually but for right now what i have is fine but i definitely am going to upgrade because i just like the aesthetic of the look um, but we'll see. I'm going to finish my bedroom, finish the living room, um, and the basement first before I do that. But yeah, I'm really excited about that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What else do I want to tell you guys? Um, I don't have much planned this weekend, which is actually good. Thinking about doing something with my hair. Um, I don't know if I'm going to get it done or what but yeah i don't know i'll go back natural i'm not sure what i'm gonna do and i definitely need a pedicure so that's probably on the agenda it is nice in the dmv today it's 80 degrees supposed to be 80 degrees let me see what the temperature is 82 degrees y'all and it's sunny it's such a nice day out but it's got a, a dress on and i have on some loafers um they're so cute i still haven't done that haul for you guys either I also need to send something back to Fashion Nova, but I don't know. My boss saw me today, and she was just like, girl, where are you going? You are disappearing. I said, hey, thank you so much. She, she definitely boosted my ego. I really hate DC traffic. Like, this is so annoying. <laughs> um, so, yeah. What else? I don't know that I'm going to take the chairs out and put the feet on them and get them upstairs. I think um, my neighbor's husband is home, Kia's husband, so I may be able to ask him to help me. But I don't know that I feel like lifting them, so I may wait until like my brother and my cousin can come do it. We'll see. Um, but I'm definitely going to go to probably Home Goods today. Um, and I'm hoping I can get home in an hour. The traffic is a little thicker than I thought. Or maybe it's just in this one area. But we'll see. Because um, my they told me that they call an hour before they come. So he told me he'd be there in an hour. I was thinking I could be home in like 45 minutes. That would be perfect timing. But I don't know. We shall see. But anyway, I will talk to you guys later. And I'll try to vlog when the um, the chairs come. Bye. You guys, I think my chairs are here. Let's go downstairs and go get them. That's the private freight company. Okay, guys, so my chairs came. I'm headed out the door to Home Goods, but I just wanted to show you what I did with them. These are some shoe boxes that I took out of my garage that I need to take upstairs. But these are the chairs right here. I do have to attach the 
feet or the legs on the bottom of them there's the instructions right there so i'll wait until i get some help to bring those upstairs but i am headed outside now to go to home goods so i will see you guys later bye y'all hey, uh it's still tuesday it's 6 59 now the mall because i had to use my um oh i need some gas i used my free panty um coupon at victoria's secret and i'll show you what i got showed y'all the last time i got a lotion for six bucks this time i spent a couple extra dollars but it was well worth it i got this you guys know i'm going to the gym starting on starting in may beginning of may so i got this it says exercise thought you said accessorize victoria's secret and this was 18 dollars, but it was 50 percent off so i got this for nine dollars and then i got a free ten dollar and fifty cent panty so i thought this was a good um purchase because i'm going to use it at the gym i needed a, a water bottle like this because taking this to the gym just doesn't work out because the top doesn't stay on it but this one is good so i'll throw this in my gym bag which is in my trunk i'm not going to show you my panty i did go to marshall's i did not find a table but i found some um a couple of things i, I found two pictures to put behind my eating kitchen table from home goods I got uh, at Marshall's. I got this uh, Shea Moisture Superfood Complex 10 in 1 Renewal System with Marula Oil and Biotin Hair Mask. I'll probably try to do this on Friday, maybe. And then I also wanted to try these. I didn't realize they were open though on the back. Um, somebody probably opened them and took one out. That's okay. But anyway, um, they're Shea Moisture uh, Raw Shea Butter Hydrating Facial Wipes with frankincense and mirth um they uh therefore they're they soothe normal to dry skin and removes makeup and dirt without rinsing or drying so this is good got that and these were 350 and this one was 7.99 actually this was 3.99 sorry about that guys and then i got one of these a lot of people say there's a difference in how you put on your foundation if you use like a, a beauty blender or makeup blender so i got this because it has the stand i've seen these months ago and i just never got one um and i didn't want to put it on my white vanity even though i do have the um acrylic cover on it i just like the fact that it came with the stand i got this from marshall's it was 3.99 all the rest of them were like 3 or 5.99 and they didn't come with the stand so i thought this was cute and i got this i also got this gum um it doesn't have aspartame in it and it's supposed to be basically keto friendly so i wanted to give it a try it's 55 pieces in here it's also sugar free and this is the peppermint so we'll see it doesn't have it does have xylitol in it but it doesn't have any of the other stuff so i just wanted to give it a try this was 2.99 at marshall's this is the first time i've seen it but yeah so i'll give this a try and leave it in the car and that's all i got today i got some stuff for my sister's shower too from home goods um but that's it so i am headed home now i need some meal prep and relax yeah update on this pure gum waste of money i put it in my mouth a couple seconds ago the flavor is already gone it's just something that you want now there was a burst of flavor when i first put it in my mouth and then that's it so it does not last and i read somewhere that this i didn't know if it was this brand or not the flavor does not last but it doesn't like literally it has not been 60 seconds yet flavor is gone so yeah don't buy this